Hello everyone, welcome to PMC Helix Video Solutions. In this video, we will learn how to troubleshoot App Dynamics Connector use cases. Navigate to the PMC Helix Intelligent Integration. Here you can see I have configured the App Dynamics Connector. To troubleshoot the common use cases for App Dynamics Connector, navigate to the Connector Configuration Settings. Verify the filters are populating the values or not. If the filters are populating the values means the data the user and roles has the required permissions on the data source verify the same for other data types such as metrics and topology second as per the given collection window five minutes verify the source app dynamics has the data present or not such as events, metrics, and topology data present for the given, given collection window time frame. Next, verify the rules assigned to the user has the required permissions as per the documents. Now, let us log into the app dynamic source to verify all these parameters. Click on the applications to see all the available applications. So this is my retail outlet application click on that and then it should show the events so i have the event data present here with the uh, date and time stamp for the retail business outlet based on the given time frame as i have the events data present in the app dynamics connector i was able to see the events present in the app dynamic in the operational management which was streamed through intelligent integration the same way to see the metric data click on the metric browser select the required retail outlet business price select the required metrics so i am able to see the required metrics as well from the source so in this way you can cross check the events and metrics data and topology data from the source app dynamics now let us verify the user and role permissions as well from the app dynamics connector on the right side you can see the settings icon click on the settings click on the administration so this administration page will display all the configured users click on the user which you have configured app dynamics connector in the intelligent integration and for the user these are the list of roles assigned of permi roles permissions assigned to that user as per the documentation we need to provide all these permissions to that user so if you cross check all these permissions default dashboard viewer and db monitor user viewer those permissions was assigned that is the reason the intelligent integration stream executed successfully and streamed the data Whenever you see the data stream was executed, but it shows the zero items, you need to cross check the user and role permissions from this page and events, metrics, and topology data from the application App Dynamics. So, this is how we can cross check the data from the connector. Thanks for watching this video. 